you know, we think about uh, that waste not want not thing again. And uh, like in our cabin build, we took all of our remnant pieces of logs and got them sawn into lumber, which we're utilizing for other projects. These are all the little cut pieces from, from the ends of logs, and there's a lot of them. But we're going to utilize them for kindling. Yeah, we've got kindling for a couple of winters here at least. But if we think about um, historically when Europeans first met natives, um, natives had no concept of waste. Um, they used everything. They utilized everything. So if they felled a cedar tree for um, a canoe belt, they would use the bark from it that you, you saw me peeling earlier um, for tying up wigwams, etc. And when Europeans did arrive here, they thought them heathens because they thought they worshipped the trees and the rocks and the water and the birds and the animals, when in fact they their religion wasn't unlike that of Christianity. They, they strictly worshipped their creator, what they felt was their creator. Um, they felt that everything had a soul, so, so the trees had a soul, rocks had a soul, but they didn't worship them. So when they would cut down a cedar tree for any application, a birch tree for birch bark, they would leave an offering of tobacco for the soul of the tree and, and in, in, in their way give thanks for um, being able to utilize that material for, for their well-being. Anyway, I decided I was going to take a bit of a break from my food case. I got the cross pieces in the bottom, my square peg driven into a round hole, and uh, yeah, when that everything dries up there and tightens up, that'll be really tight, really strong. And I'm going to uh, finish up this pile. Might take me longer than I thought. And uh, then I'm going to get back at the food case.
So this is the second food cache I built. The first one, I built it one stick at a time up on the platform, but I've gotten smart in my old age. So I've prefabbed the uh, things. I've got most of them done here. i got one more to do over there. And uh, yeah, we're going to haul them up and put this thing together.